We need to film your intro before we do your full song and the day in the life. You want to talk about it? You want to film your intro with me? I'm in my Sunday best. We should get you dressed. You want to get dressed for your Sunday best? Well, listen, he's about to give you the shirt off his back, so it's a little bit big on you. Isn't this an extra small? Got to pack on those pounds, Mr. Man. You want to say hello? Look at your little spirit jersey. <gasps> oh, what a beauty. All right, you guys, welcome officially to our yearly Carl video. You look very dapper. So it's usually a task and a half. Hopefully my background is somewhat clean. Now, I will be honest, it is usually um, interesting trying to film a day in the life of Carl or Carl's day routine, but you guys seem to love it. So here we are. I'm also gonna answer a bunch of questions about Carl. This year has been interesting. Carl got himself a trainer, Sarah. He loves Sarah. So we will leave all of Carl's trainer information down below. Um, she keeps him quite often, actually. He goes back for little refreshers and some babysitting stints. And especially as we're gonna start traveling again, he's gonna stay with her, which is awesome. But at the beginning of the year, he stayed with her for, I believe it was four weeks and a little bit. And she trained him, she made him more obedient, but she also gave us tools and tips and tricks. Did you just burp? tools and tips and tricks to help us as dog owners and as doggy parents to help him be more calm. Now, the thing with Carl is he's, I aggressive would be putting it mildly. He gets anxiety, but like looking at him right now, you're like, okay, how? Cause he's like the cutest little teddy bear, which makes it very complicated whenever we walk him. So we walk him a ton. We try and tucker him out as much as we can. But ever since moving to this house, it's as though he flipped a switch like overnight. I don't know if it's the size of the house or something happened that we weren't aware of, but he gets really, really nervous around people and he will, to put it as bluntly as I can, he will bite, but he has little needle teeth. So obviously it's a good thing that he's not a big dog, but it still hurts. Um, he got me the other day and it, you can barely even see it. And sometimes it won't even draw blood, but because his teeth are like little needles, it freaking hurts. And obviously we don't want anybody losing a finger. So we keep him either in his crate or tied back or just in a separate room if we have guests, which this year has not been a problem. Hey, Carl, is quarantine your favorite thing ever? I think all dogs love quarantine. It's like the greatest ever. More walks. You love that word, right? <laughs> so he's had a very good year. Um, he's a super good dog and he's really, really smart. He can do a ton of tricks, which you're gonna see in his day in the life. But he, he's perfect with Andre and I, and once he gets to know someone, he's awesome. So when he first met his trainer, I really wish I would have filmed that video that day because he wanted to take her head off. And now he like loves her. So. The other thing is anybody that he knew as a little, little baby, he's good with. So Andre's parents, he's really good with them. Um, his groomer, he's really good, but we just don't trust him a ton with all people. So that has been difficult, but with his trainer, things have helped a ton. The other thing I wanted to share that I've been sharing on my stories is pet well-being. So they have melatonin drops for puppies. They also have, and I'll just take you over to Carl's little area. We'll give you a breather. You in your bed with your snake? He loves, he loves that Nightmare Before Christmas snake. He's obsessed with it. It was in my Disney haul and he loves it. Okay, so this is Carl's little eatery area, but I've got these little drops. So this is the melatonin from Pet Wellbeing. Absolutely amazing. I'll link it down below. This is the Stress Gold. I used this yesterday. And the way that I give it to him is I, I don't try and give it to him orally, come on. I just uh, mix it with some pump, like as in orally, as in I don't put the drops right in his mouth. He'll, he would never want that. So I mix it with pumpkin puree. He loves pumpkin puree. And this one's called calming care. So they're all different, but they all ultimately do the same thing where they keep him calm and chill. The other thing I wanted to share was something that we got for Carl. First, actually, let's talk food. We just did a little photo shoot today. He is allergic to all poultry, so he does a lot of sweet potato, a lot of fish. So those are his treats. Yeah. You want to show them your artwork? So we got this super cute artwork, and a lot of you guys have sent DMs to Carl and I. By the way, Carl has Instagram, in case you didn't know. But a lot of people have seen the picture of Carl next to his artwork being like, do you know that Carl's in an advertisement? Yes, we know. So this is by Weston Willow. So if you have a fur baby of your own, you can get a little artwork made. I think it's the cutest freaking thing. 
we're gonna get a holiday one made. Oh, what's that? You wanna be in the shot? You're back? Hi, shocker. If you're new to this channel, Carl loves the spotlight. Anytime that the camera starts, he's, he's there. He's in like Flynn. Look who it is. Carl, you showing off your shirt? I know it looks really yellow right now. Do you wanna turn around so people can see it? Look, we match you and I. It's like we're ready for a not so scary Halloween party or something. Do you wanna turn around or you wanna just? Okay, that's fine. Little bit socially awkward as well. Oh, I feel like there's some pink fluff in the camera. You're, prop you're propped up on Carl's little poof. So he usually will sit here next to me as I work. He's a very interesting dog with tons of personality. Wouldn't trade it for the world. Um, just makes things a little bit complicated whenever we have guests over. But if you have, <laughs> you're so fun. If you have any questions about Carl, I can rapid fire off some stuff. He is five years old. He loves salmon. He's a little bit mad at me right now. Can you see this? This is the attitude that it, he is in a full mood. Carl, like, it's like you want to be in the camera and you want the attention, but you're not sure. He really doesn't like wearing clothing. Oh, Halloween costumes. We have a couple options. You'll have to follow his Instagram page to find out. All right, you ready? You ready for your day in the life? You usually like it because it includes a ton of treats and some walking. You look so mad, dude. Let's show, let's show them your, uh, your patch as well, your soul patch. Okay, one second. If anybody else would do this, they'd lose a finger, wouldn't they? You know it, but not mommy. There we go. Are you happy? Are you happy? It's dramatic. So you guys, Carl's got his adult fur growing in. Can you see that little dark patch on his bum? He's officially a big boy. What is this? So dramatic. All right, I'm gonna take you guys through a full day in the life of Carl. Hopefully you guys enjoy. Roll the tape. You wanna say bye? Don't forget to follow me on Instagram. Love you guys. All right, ready? Let's do this. It's gonna be a fine day today, I can see It's gonna be a fine day today, I can see Gonna be a fine day today, for you and me It's gonna be